Have you ever thought about the power of social media? Social media has the power to make your business grow. Grow! Yeah. Why don't you let us manage your social media? Because our business is to see your business grow. Visit us at www.beastdownmedia.co.za. Corporates are quite excited about it, they're not yet budgeting. Around a quarter of the big corporations have got a strategy or a budget for uh, smart city deployment. And if they don't have a strategy, they're not going to have a budget. But they're waiting for the authorities to facilitate smart city uh, deployment. And the reason for that is because they see it as, as providing a massive boost to the economy. That's probably their single biggest benefit of smart cities from a corporate point of view. And hand in hand with that boosting of the economy, they also expect it to attract new businesses and then also to enhance their own efficiencies because of the improved infrastructure. And all of those go hand in hand, but ultimately it boosts the economy of the city. So it makes sense for the city and for the businesses operating in that city. Initially, we can only be a smarter city and eventually become a smart city. Uh, research has shown that it takes up to 15 years to fully uh, deploy a smart city strategy. But businesses can't stand still while they're waiting for that to happen. So they have to create an environment in which they can operate in a smart city-like kind of ecosystem. So they would invest in their own deployment of smart city type infrastructure or to support the border infrastructure. But at the same time, they're pushing for that border infrastructure to be deployed so that they can plug into it. There's actually two key elements. The one is funding, because without funding you can't really deploy effectively. So the uh, big businesses are unanimous that you need serious funding. But um, the other, which seems fairly straightforward, but um, it's only starting to um, rise in people's awareness, is the need for fibre infrastructure. Because with fibre infrastructure you can do almost anything that requires a data transfer. But you need that extensively, you need it everywhere, and you need it to be almost uh, like electricity supply. Each city is at a different level, but each of the major cities is thinking about smart city de deployment. But in most cases, all we are seeing is uh, small projects, one-off projects, or um, uh, disparate projects which aren't connected to each other. Until you have all of these initiatives being part of a broader framework and a broader strategy, you're not really on the way to becoming a smart city. So you could say we still had a proof of concept level for individual projects and not yet even proof of concept for a smart city as a whole. There's absolutely no question that a smart city deployment and smart city technologies have to start off with security as part of the fabric of the smart city. It's not something you can add on afterwards. So if it's not part of the strategy, if it's not part of the uh, deployment, you're uh, flirting with disaster because it will be so easy to bring city services and urban um, services to a standstill by hacking into them if there isn't proper security. But that security can't be an afterthought. You have to start with security as part of your planning. For more stories like these, go to www.social-tv.co.za, subscribe to us on YouTube and follow us on our social mediums.